Victims of our recent severe weather, including a deadly tornado, can start getting federal assistance. Resource centers were opened in North Texas, including one in Denton County. More than two dozen Texas counties are eligible to apply for federal assistance. Additional resource centers are expected to open soon. Fox Force Peyton Yeager is in Denton County tonight with more on the story. De Peyton. Stephen FEMA tells us that as long as there is a need, they will keep these recovery centers open. Now, the deadline uh, to apply for federal assistance is set for mid-July. Governor Abbott could extend that deadline, but FEMA encourages people to get started as soon as possible. Telling us to take cover now. The time I got to the living room, the front wall blew down, the second wall blew down. I jumped on top of her and the uh, dogs and the uh, uh, roof blew off. We was watching uh, debris fly around. God had his finger on us, keep, keeping us from getting blown away. Tim Love traveled to Sanger in his damaged pickup truck Thursday afternoon. His Valley View home of 30 years is unlivable following the EF3 tornado that tore through Cook County on May 25th. House pretty much gone, barn, fences, uh, cow barn, just about everything. This is a photo of what's left of one of Love's barns. He brought a blueprint sketch of his property to Butterfield Elementary in Sanger, now a temporary FEMA disaster recovery center. Love says he's having trouble logging into FEMA's website. The reality is a lot of people want to see someone, an actual human, and talk face-to-face -face with someone versus talking to someone over the phone or just doing it online. In Denton, Eastland, and Waller counties, FEMA employees are now offering in-person, one-on-one help to Texans affected by severe storms, tornadoes, flooding, and straight-line winds dating back to April 26. More than two dozen Texas counties are eligible to apply for federal assistance. As long as you live in one of those eligible counties that are part of this federal disaster declaration, you are more than welcome to come out to any disaster recovery center in the state of Texas to see us. The goal at the recovery centers? To be a one-stop shop in disaster aid. In addition to FEMA walking storm victims through their applications, the Small Business Administration, the Red Cross, and United Way also have staffed booths. Denton County Emergency Management is also helping people with hotel vouchers and replacing legal documents. The main way is basic home repairs. We want to get you in your home so safe, sanitary, secure, and habitable. You may be able to use the assistance for medical, dental. And if people can't make it to one of these centers, FEMA also has crews also out in the field. They also announced today that they are opening another recovery center that's going to be at Valley View Elementary School in Cook County. That opens tomorrow, starting tomorrow at 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Uh, it's open through the weekend, and they're hoping that we'll, they will receive more foot traffic since people are off work.